And straight into the live action we go. It's week two, Major League Rugby. Utah Warriors on the left of your screen in black on the right. The New England Free Jacks. Who've made home here in Las Stop. Vegas this week. They kick it to the touch line that side. The Sam Boyd Stadium, Vandenberg. Yep. Stick. 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 Pops out to the right hand side. Scott, he's hooker with him. Use it. They go to the big man from Johannesburg, South Africa. Colors missed. Schultz goes wide. Oh, big contact there on Hawaii. Looking to hold him up there. Liam Steele went in to engage. He's opposite number. Yeah. Palatavau pops up, trips across field and kicks for his winger. Vainakolo. Oh, but it's been taken beautifully and the ball stripped free there from Wakanabao. They'll come back to the advantage. And you're right, this is the side last week, Utah, that led 16-8 at half time against Rugby ATL. So they started superbly, played a quality 60 minutes. This is how they started last week. First points on offer, they'll take. It's 3-0, the Utah Warriors lead successful. Brother Harry is a Irish sheep farmer, also international sevens player. They go to Larson. Maul is set for New England. They have advantage. Warriors have come from the side. They look to bring their backs into play. Stepping back with the left hand via the vice captain. And from New Zealand as well. Here they go, Dewey. One of their star players. Still they work the same side. Larson fires it to Wilson. Gets the ball away. Wilson's a miracle ball. Are they in the corner? Green says yes. New England have five. They've chanced their arm, and they've come good again in Las Vegas. Fabulous skill from Mitch Wilson. Four-time collegiate All-American, captain them in 2018. Okay. Going against his brother today, as Danny mentioned earlier in the broadcast, he got the offload superbly away. And it was Pasa Wakanabao. They got the try, the man from Talebu in Fiji. Difficult conversion attempt on the side here from Young Guillermo. Yes, hits the upright. Couldn't get closer than that. Second penalty attempt for Hagen Schult. Man from St. Bede's College. Turns quickly. Flags go up to Stunner in Las Vegas. 6 5. Utah lead New England after 25 minutes. Try and get a penalty again, and that could be someone in the bin right there if you want to play smart. They go to Jensen. Ball slips down and Vani Kolo in open space. Fetu Vani Kolo throws a dummy. Vani Kolo, this man is a magician. He might as well stay here in Las Vegas because he has entertained every single person. One looked up, held the ball for support, realized he'd run too far away from it, and did it all himself. Stunning bit of work here as Schilt raises the flags yet again. Jackson Thebus, who started it all, picks now with a red scrum cap. Not there yet. Connor Kondragon is on ring 19. He's in there also. Advantage now for New England. They've got to score here. Poland keeps it tight. Did the ball come? Three jacks have backs to the right and the left. They go over the top. It's going to be a penalty. Yes, try. Try, yeah, awarded. Try awarded. Yes, try awarded. Oh. Scott Green, so yeah, casual try. in baby blue. We missed the dive over the top. It was awarded. New England, right back in this. Game on. Two tries on the board for New England for their 10. As uh, Timmy say Guillermo gets an extra two. One point the difference so far. Three and a half to go in this first half. Up soon. It's 13-12. Utah over New England after 40 minutes. McNulty. Player qualifies for the US and Ireland. They go wide. Steel. What can about? What can about? Get off me, he says. A stunning try, a double for Pawasa, Wakanabao, and New England take the lead. Guillermo from the touchline, makes no mistake. It took them three minutes and they're up 19-13. Such a nice unit 
by the free Jackson. Poland against Knight through. The little magician gets it away. Stunning stop. Mike Sale. He's just shredded the defense. Oh, to Utah, but beautiful executed rugby. Bonus point try as well. Poland sniping, sniping all day. A couple of great breaks, and this time, though, beautiful linking from Mike. So it wasn't even on the starting side, had it come in a late replacement for Bodine Waka. It's an admission service for the Church of mate, 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 Jesus Christ mate, mate, of Latter day mate, Saints. Returned to Utah, that's how he found his way into the Warriors outfit. One of many changes to their new squad in 2020 as they surge for the line. They pull it out to Schultz, who kicks for the corner. Vainikolo is there, Fetu Vainikolo has a head start. Clearing through the side. Just the third one, Josh, we can't have that. Yellow card for eight white there. Hemopo. Set. Ball is in as the free jack slide backwards, and up they go again. Surely that's seven points. They go around the short town. Blotovo is in. Well, the four packs only ate their veggies, and the Utah Warriors get in. And a try for the Utah Warriors. Number nine, scrum half. What a day more. I saw that, yeah. Leading one point in the spot, and I got that one. Base the court, score the try. A captain's try from Dwayne Palotavao. The kick will go to the side. He's 26 points to 18. For, 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 for the free jacks. But it was a lovely break from Whippy. You know, I mean, um, from Gannon Moore. Coming back on the inside, exposing the sort of lazy forwards in the middle on a kick chase. And it's that bit from them. Anything else? I'm not sure exactly what he's seeing there for the penalty. By your 14. Oh. So 14. Yes. Yep. 14. Step, step, boys. No, just wait here. Step. Lots of foul. Looks for his forwards. They dig in low. Uhila. Cuts back in. Five meters out. Uhila goes again. Seven. Now Vandenberg. Going for the line. Franco Vandenberg. Just short. Advantage for the Warriors again. They try to spin free there. Wonga Koto can't get through. Schultz is back. Potabao finds his fly off. Hammers it out wide. Whippy. Josh Whippy. Oh, what a ball. Moore collects it superbly. Had it go back. Couldn't reach for the line. But they're in the corner. Celebrations go up. Referee Scott Green's got to check with his. Please try. Okay, try. It's, it's the ill discipline of the Free Jacks that are allowing uh, Utah to really take control again. Flags go up as well. It's still a trail, it's, but it's 26 25. Uh, but Utah are thoroughly in the driving seat here. Here they go through Cullen. New England back to 15 with no, Boasso Akanabao on the right. field, the right wing. New England looks to counterattack, but <laughs> Warriors still close to the line as they get low. Mongoloa is there as well. The back start to celebrate. They're on the line, try ward it. It's like Utah seem the fresher team right now, which is something we haven't maybe seen at times, and that's a big plus sign if you're a Utah fan. Well, the bonus point try is converted as well. It's 32-26. Forward, looking for the dummy there. It was Talalolo Tumawa. Look at him going again. He had a brilliant break earlier. Tuiloma, such a massive frame. Schultz, big dummy, it opens up. Schultz goes against Green, chips over the top. 
just saved there by the New England Free Jacks. Sampier comes in, but in a five metre scrub, it's not over yet. I'm getting over, but it comes from the kick chase, uh, from the kick counter. Finally sees the ability, Whippy sees Ganamore. Ganamore has time, he sees two forwards, he sees the disconnect. They look like there could have been a little shove from the Utah guy on the line creating that hole. But then Whippy gets the ball back, back could have backed himself, hits Ganamore, then hits Vasco with the offload. The, the confidence to keep the ball alive, to keep the offload, not to pin your ears and go for the corner. That is a try perfectly worked five. try. And Ganamore the creator. Flags go up yet again. Arrange it up on the left hand side. Phoebus. Step boy step. Still to the left. Wilson skips. He's in the corner. Mitch Wilson. We're going to have to look to see if he's in. What time? The clear. Um, he helps to touch. Okay, well. Try it is. Mitch Wilson bags one in the corner. They'll bring the score to 59 31. Wow. From the side. What a kick. What a kick. Outstanding ability. Yes, there's time for them to still win the game. But if the dust settles and this finish was a Utah win, that's a bonus point that could matter down in the season that you'll come back to that one unbelievable kick. That's right. Banging on the board is Mike Sell. Oh, last play here. For the last play yeah. for New England and their Wait. chances. John. They'll go one on one if the score remains. On top. John Stick. Have to keep it alive and run from their own 22. And Mopo gets to Kanabao, flicks it in beautifully. Great bit of skill. Here it comes to Beard, the vice captain. Man who grew up in Christchurch, New Zealand. Short ball. Larson's been a workhorse. The man mullet is there as well. Secura. Poland throws a dummy. Oh, and a stick to go as well. Poland. Got through a couple. He's isolated though. Turnover ball. It's the Warriors that get over this. And that is their game. They've finished off this match. It's what Chris Latham, the head coach, wanted, and they've answered. Tap it, yeah, and kick it. They tap and smash this one to the touch. The Warriors claim their first victory of 2020, bouncing back from last weekend's loss. They make a statement in the Eastern Conference. They down New England, fresh from the upset of New York. Final score, 39-33 at Sam Boyd Stadium. We'll have plenty more after the break here in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada.